the division. The Division II state championship game between Keystone and Greenville should be a classic. Ashley Haynes has been one of the state's hottest pitchers and has not lost since April 6th. She'll match up against a lineup reminiscent of Murderer's Row. Kenzie Conrad has 11 homers and 45 RBI on the season. She looks to hit and pitch Keystone to their third state title. The Division II softball championship game starts right now on Sports Time Ohio. From Firestone Stadium in Akron, Ohio, good day and welcome into our coverage of the OHSAA Championships. Division II softball here this afternoon with the sunshine out, the wind blowing, and a great matchup. Keystone will be taking on Greenville. Along with Joey Arietta, I'm Al Pulowski. Great to have you along here on Sports Time Ohio for our coverage. And Joey, pretty good matchup today for the Division II final. We had a great matchup. We got a great matchup between pitchers. We got a great matchup against hitters. I guess it's going to come down to who can play defense. That sounds pretty good. Let's talk about some key players now. First up for Keystone, a couple of players that are batting over 500. One of those, Erin Pond. She's hitting 536 on the year and has nine homers. She's also scored 44 runs and uh, chipped in 45 RBIs. I think the really key for her is she has had a 625 on base percentage. And that is an outstanding mark for her. It sure is. The second player that we want to highlight here in the open is Bree Buckley, who's batting 506. She has seven homers in these couple of key players here on offense. Well, these two pack a lot of punch here. Uh, 32 runs scored for uh, Buckley, 47 RBIs, and she too has a 625 on base percentage. So these two young ladies are really going to be the offensive threats for Keystone. All right, it sounds good. And for Greenville, of course, they've got some great offensive players as well. We'll talk about a couple of those here. Paige Walter is one, another hitter, batting over 500 on the season. You know, she's doing very, very well. 543, uh, 51 hits. I think that that is amazing that, that she's been able to pound out that many hits over the course of the season. Kayla Harshberger is another one that really can hit the, the softball. She's hitting 475 coming into today's game. But uh, these two players, very key to the offensive attack. Absolutely. 35 RBIs on the season already. She, too, has 51 hits on the season. So if you're looking for the key for these two teams, it's going to be these two players on the Greenville side of the, the field and the two players on the, on the Keystone side of the field. See who gets the better of each other. All right, Joe, and of course you've uh, talked about keys, so let's talk about a marathon keys to the game here today. First up, for Keystone, two things that they have to get done. Well, Keystone, I think Conrad's got to control the game. She's, she doesn't give up a lot of free passes, which is outstanding. Uh, she limits, uh, you know, she's always around the plate, which is a, a very important uh, feature for a pitcher. They need to attack early to test Greenville's ability to play defense. And I think that if, if uh, Keystone can get on the board early, it's going to really, really force Greenville to come through. All right, so those are the marathon keys for the game here today. And you're set for Division II State Championship Softball from Akron. It's on Sports Time Ohio. Stick around. The starting lineups and the ball game coming up next. Today's Division II Softball Championship game is brought to you by Farmers. We are insurance, we are farmers. By Taco Bell, live Moss. By Time Warner Cable, enjoy sports better only with Time Warner Cable. And by Marathon, fueling the American spirit. 